Before I begin today's video, I just wanted to say nothing too disgusting will be talked about in this video. So the first story begins when I was around 7 years old. The elementary school that I went to was really old. Like, to put it into perspective, the windows we had were from the 60s and they were really cracked and we couldn't replace them because we didn't have any money either. So, as you can probably guess, the bathroom wasn't in any better condition when I went there. So, I was in the bathroom, I finished what I had to do, and I went to unlock the stall door, and it wouldn't unlock. I got locked into a bathroom stall. Luckily for me, two other girls were in the bathroom. I told them that I was stuck, and one left to get a teacher while the other one stayed to comfort me, considering I was crying at this point. Keep in mind, I was only 7, and I legit thought I was gonna spend the rest of my life in the bathroom stall. Luckily for me, the girl that left to get a teacher found one rather quickly, and she told me to crawl out beneath the space um, that was near the floor to get out, which is what I wanted to do in the first place, but the girl stayed with me told me not to because the floor was dirty. Thanks a lot, Kathy. No, seriously, thank you for um, helping me. The next story happened more recently. So, it was after school, and I was getting ready to leave, but before I did, I decided to use the bathroom. I asked a friend of mine to wash my stuff while I was in the bathroom, and so I went inside, and I went to the one open stall up there was, and I saw a shirt floating in the toilet. Yes, you heard me right. A freaking shirt. How the hell do you lose a shirt in the toilet? Like, what? What? So yeah, the moral of the story, kids, is don't lose your shirt in the toilet. Now, I actually have more really weird bathroom stories, but I deciding, I decided to... <laughs> sorry, this part's unscripted. I'm deciding to leave that for a uh, different video. If this one gets like enough people liking it and wanting to hear more, then I'll share them. But as of now, it's just going to be a one-parter. So yeah, see you guys next time.